Let's start. Today we will see how to use a for loop in the TradingView Pine script. This is the indicator function with name for loop. Here we have created an array of integers and added some data to it. We have covered the array topic in one of our previous videos. What we will do is, we will loop through this array and add its data in a single variable and then plot that addition as a result on the chart. The result variable will hold the addition of array data as the final result. The size variable calculates the size of the array, which we will need for the for loop. Here we have used the for loop. The loop starts from the zeroch position and ends till all the data from the array is looped through. Here we have used the array.get function to get the data from the array. And then we keep adding it to the result variable. And finally, we have plotted the result. Let's add this indicator to the chart. As you can see, the for loop has worked and it has added all the data from the array into the result variable, and its final value is 10. So that's it. That's how you can work with a for loop in the TradingView Pine script. Thank you.